Oh no! It's snowing outside. What is going on? <laughs> Welcome back, everybody. It's winter. Winter is here. Nuggets! Oh man! You okay, Nuggets? You you want me to get you a heater? You should really close your door. It's freezing out here. Oh man. Good thing you got those feathers to protect you. Here, uh, let me, let me. <laughs> Nuggets, do you want to demonstrate something for us? <laughs> you know where this is going. Any last words? Nuggets? Nuggets? Uh -huh. <laughs> so I have updated, guys. That is what's going on here. And crazy things are happening. Uh, so the reason Nuggets died originally is because of a, a glitch where he was taking five times the damage he should have, and he wasn't able to regen. That has changed. Nuggets 2.0 here can recover health, and I won't instantly kill him <laughs> when I try to take a feather out of him. Um, when I logged off, it was not snowing, so some stuff has changed with the weather, I think. And also, I was not starving to death. Oh, oh, that was that's the end of our pork. <laughs> you know the pork we we got at the very beginning of this. It has lasted until now, and now we have no more pork. Oops, and there goes the beans too. So, <laughs> I was going to uh, go harvest our crops right away here in preparation for winter, but winter has beat us to it. So we better go check on them. Somebody tipped me off that uh, I want to get out of here, guy. You're distracting. You're distracting us. Somebody said in the comments that uh, I need to harvest the crops before winter. Otherwise, they are going to die and I won't get the seeds from them. Which... Oh, they're gone! Oh, but the seeds are on the ground. <laughs> Let's get these quickly. Oh, it's good we checked the checked this out when we did here. Oh, he stole my seeds. Are you kidding me? I'll take on your home whole gang here. I don't care. I want my seeds back. Oh man. Can I take these guys all on? <laughs> I don't know. My seeds, my seeds. Ah! <laughs> oh, they got reinforcements coming. Okay, this is getting dangerous. They got another guy. I think he's got a sword too. Oh. Or no, it's a shovel. Is that a shovel or an axe? Or a hammer? What is that? Alright, nuts to this. I got the seeds. Let's get out of here. <laughs> This is getting dangerous. Oh, we should take water too. I wanted to check something with ice, but we can't. Oh! Is it raining now? What's going on? Look at all these zombies, man! Holy smokes! Oh, the, it's snowing here, though. So, temperature is based on uh, elevation, too. So, as I get higher here, I think it turns to snow. Whoa! Why is this caving in when I go up my ladders now? Let's go inside. <laughs> I want to be inside. I don't like it out there. It's all cold and miserable. Oh, too much stuff is happening here. I'm feeling overwhelmed. So, what was I going to say? What was I going to do here? Uh, yeah, I'm worried. Somebody said I should stock up on water before winter because I might not be able to get it when everything freezes. But I guess we'll have to check that later because there is way too many zombies out there. I notice the windows are glitching out a little bit. But there's been a lot of bug fixes in this version. Believe it or not. <laughs> uh, Alright. Maybe uh, we should wait till day and then resume recording. Oh, stuff is melting again. So I thought 
by the way. I thought winter had come and was disappearing because I saw stuff melting earlier. But that is apparently just because of temperature changes, like uh, natural variations in the temperature according to the day, like day and night. Night is cooler than day, so stuff stuff was freezing and melting and freezing and melting. But winter is definitely here now. Oh man, he followed me home. I remember you from last night. Mr. Is it a hammer? I think it's a hammer. Oh, he's got a buddy with him, too. Oh, man. So now that it's daytime, it warms up during the day, right? So all the snow is disappearing again. Oh. <laughs> keep going. Keep going. I'm guessing as it gets closer to true winter, uh, the snow sticks around more and more. Um, so we got a lot to do today. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> I love it when it's like a brand new day and, it, and the rain just disappears. Because then you know for sure you're going to have a good day. It's not going to rain during the day or anything like that because it's done it already. Uh, we're going to be cutting down some trees though. You know what? Actually, I'm going to go somewhere else instead of by our home here. Let's go somewhere where, where we don't care if we make it ugly or anything. We'll cut down the trees out this way. Uh, and I want to start making some charcoal. Oh, <laughs> I don't know why I walked near this thing. I want to see it, but I know it's dangerous. Okay, let's keep going. Oh, this is a tree I've never seen actually, or never noticed. What is this? It's got branches. Is this like a willow tree? Wait a second. Let's get, let's see what type of wood this is. So basically, we gotta chop down a bunch of trees and get a lot of logs. Put them in a big pile, light it on fire without any oxygen around, and it will convert it all into charcoal over time. So what is this? Is that hickory? Oh, we've had hickory wood before. I guess some of the trees, uh, like that's a hickory tree right there. But that one we just saw had branches, so maybe some are bigger than others. Oh yeah! Creeper attack. He's trying to blow up my wood pile. Whew. All right, guys, check it out. This is our log pile. I ended up cutting down three sequoia trees. That's these uh, these ones here, these big, tall two by two ones uh, to get all this. This is solid. Should get a ton of charcoal from this. And we're doing it in kind of a classic design here. So we got to cover it. You gotta make sure none of the wood is exposed to air. So you can put dirt all around it or some other block. Put it on top. And then we're gonna light the middle. And I think it expands out from the middle to the edges, maybe. Alright, let's put it like this. Hopefully I'm doing this right. <laughs> I'm gonna be sad if I waste all this wood for nothing. Put some sticks down there. Get a fire starter. Okay. It's going. I think we can put one more. Oh, not not now. Please, not now. Oh, man. Oh, there's a creeper, too. I saw a creeper. It's doing things. Oh. <laughs> oh, that was close. All right. So our charcoal pile is on its way. We'll have to check it later. You see how smoke is coming out of the top? That's pretty cool. And not just in the middle. It's it's spread to the other blocks already. I'm not sure how long it takes. We'll, we'll, we'll just have to keep an eye on it, I guess. Alright, guys. So we're going to start something else here. We're going to need a bucket. 
some planks, I guess. Flux. Um, when I was cutting down those trees, I noticed... Well, as I've been cutting down trees, I've noticed something kind of interesting. A little technical detail I'm picking up on. Um, most trees will drop like one, two, or three saplings, I find. But there's a couple types. The birch trees and the sequoia trees in particular. I've never gotten a sapling from a sequoia tree, and I've cut cut down like six of them so far. Um, which has me wondering, <laughs> how do I get saplings? Then I noticed something... Oh yeah, I, I made a little bench area here for our ingots, by the way. I noticed something, though. One time... Like, I almost never get saplings from birch trees, but one time I cut one down in a different biome and it dropped three. Which has me thinking that maybe getting saplings is biome dependent or temperature dependent or maybe even season dependent. I don't know. Oh, it is it's early winter now. Oh, man. Alright, anyway. So can we break ice and still make water? Yeah, we can. Can we pick up ice? No. Okay. We are going to finally <laughs> do something with our hides here. Oh, these are small hides, darn it. Um, okay, so this is full of water. Can we fill this up? We're going to need, I think, three barrels total to do all this. But we're, we're going to try to prepare the hides. We have everything we need to do it now. So we got to make two more barrels. Oh, that's cool. They keep the color. <laughs> We've got some pine barrels now. That's awesome. All right. Uh, I think you need water and then mix it with the flux. And that gets you lime water. Special type of water. Full of lime. <laughs> all right. Uh, we're going to have to fill up the barrel with this. I don't know if I have to fill it all the way. I might not need to. Oh, did that not... Uh Oops. Oh, I clicked the wrong barrel. No. Give me the water back. Give me the water back. <laughs> no. Can I... Uh, it's probably going to save it, too. Lime water. Darn it. All right. So we need four barrels. <laughs> four barrels. Oh, man. Get another one down. Let's see. How do we do this? Whoops. Oh, that's interesting. Alright. This one we can fill with water. Just regular water. Oh, I put that in the... Oh. I'm mixing all the waters up. Okay, we'll fill this one all the way. There's a point to this. Trust me. Just, just wait for it. So now we can create a barrel of tannin which you use to tan hides into leather. Uh, you put a piece of wood in and then seal it, I believe. Yeah, okay, so that's m converting the water into tannin. This we need regular water in, and then we need lime water. Maybe let's get a little bit more of that since we wasted some. <laughs> um, all right, so it's the middle barrel. I should have made them each a different color. All right, let's do one more barrel. Let's see if that works. Okay, so I should have put these in order too. I think the first step is to put in the lime water. I don't know if we can do several at once. Seal it. Yeah, okay. So that is going to uh, soak for a little bit. And I think after a few hours we can uh, process it further. We're going to head up here too. I've decided I want to put my... Wait, actually, let's get some rocks first. We're going to put our forge up on this side of the hill. Let's see. Can we click it? Click it? No? Oh, we need a hammer. Whoops. We can do that. We have the technology. There's so much to this mod. It's amazing. Like, there's so many, <laughs> so many details to it. They put a lot of work into it. Did a really good job. There we go. Smooth stone. I'm going to collect a little bit of this and then we'll move on to our next step. 
Oh man, I just noticed something. There's an in and out button here. And an empty button too. <laughs> I bet you I can get it back. Oh, I should have hit this one first. That totally drains it and resets it. I bet if I hit out and put this in, it would have picked it up. Oh well. Anyway, doesn't matter too much. I should check this. No, they're still both going. Okay. Uh, it is night time, but maybe we can get lucky and not get harassed by the mobs. So let's head up here. I do have torches too. Um, I was going to put... Let's see, there's not really a lot of space over here. Maybe we will go to this spot. Do a little terraforming. We're going to set up a forge area here with like an anvil and maybe a little covering of some sort and you know, all that cool stuff. But just for right now, <laughs> we're going to do it really simply. Um, let's see, maybe we'll put it... Where's a good spot? Uh, let's put it over here, I guess. Uh, it doesn't matter too much. So you need it uh, covered by stone on five sides. So you have to have it at the bottom there, then here, there, there, and there. And then it burns in the middle there. Just for looks, I'm going to add some in the corners, though. All right. And you can use coal or charcoal. I don't think coal has any other purpose besides this forge here. So we may as well use it for this. You make it into a block, put it in the middle, and then when you're ready, you can light it. Um, which we're not quite ready right now. We should wait till day. Uh, let's check on some of our other things. We got lots going on right now. We got <laughs> we got the charcoal pit. We got our our leather on the go. Two things, three things, if you count the forge. I guess that's not very much. Did this cave in? Oh, it's done. I think it's done. <coughs> Oh man, but it's... Nope, now is not the time. Yeah, I don't see any more of it like, smoldering there, so I think it is done. Nuggets, is it safe to go outside yet? It looks like it's daytime. Are you sure it's not daytime? I think it's daytime. Sky's blue, Nuggets! This guy, he doesn't crow. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Hmm. You know, Nuggets, not not to play favorites or anything, but the original Nuggets would crow every morning. I wonder what's up with that. Yeah, it's way past the point where he should have. Hmm. Interesting. Maybe he never learned how to sing. That could be it. Actually, let's do this first because this is going to take longer. So I'm pretty sure enough time has passed now that we should be able to do this. I'm wondering, I think I only put three buckets of lime water, so it might have only done three hides. Oh no, it did them all. And there's still some left. Okay. So we got small soaked hide. Take that out. We're going to move that to the water barrel. I think we got to seal it again. Oh wait, no, no, no. Aha, there's one more step to it. <laughs> now we got to scrape off all the the gunk to it, right? There we go. So it goes from small soaked tide to small scraped tide. Do that for all of them. And then it's ready to soak. So the lime water gets all the dead guts off. Oh, I think the ice just melted. All right, so let's put that in there. Seal it. Okay, it's almost done. <laughs> I'm going to move this barrel. This is lime water. Yeah, let's move this to the other side so I don't keep mixing them up. Put that one over here. It, oh, this is tannin now. Good. We will move that one next to it. Can I uh, can I pick this up quicker with an axe? Oh, you can. Excellent. We're learning things as we play this. Okay. No, I don't need a drink. I'm good. Um, let's go. What do we do next? I guess let's go check out our charcoal pit. See what's going on with that. I think it's all done. I'm pretty sure you need a shovel to get it. Oh yeah, look at that. So this is interesting. It's not all the same height. I wonder why that is. Because there was exactly... Whoa. <laughs> there was exactly... 
uh, 16 in each of these. I made sure in each wood pile. Mm, that's not how to do it. Oh, you gotta hold it. Okay. Oh man, this is gonna take forever to dig out. <laughs> I think I need a better shovel. Oh man. I think it's one eighth of a block each time. That's cool. So we got charcoal. We need this for uh, whenever we heat up ores and stuff. Uh, I think you can also use it to make char or uh, gunpowder. I don't think you can make torches this way. No. Yeah. To make torches, you need to put them in a fire pit. Sticks. Um, I'll get this later, I guess. Let's head on over to our forge. I got the the copper on me too. We're gonna move it to to buy our forge. All right. Set up a table here. I guess we should put our stone anvil here too. We're not gonna do it over there, by our house there. Oh yeah, we gotta chop this tree down <laughs> so it doesn't catch on fire. Is this a floating dirt block? <laughs> what on earth is that about? Okay. I guess we can go ahead and light it. I'm a little worried I'm going to mess this up. Oh, that is cool. It's animated and everything. Okay, we got to put coal in. We're going to put molds in over there. This is in case we overheat an ingot. I think it'll catch it. Instead of losing it, like if it melts, it'll just drip through the fire. Uh, but if that's there, it'll that'll catch it, I think. Oh, <laughs> um, yeah, I think we're doing this right. Let's put our copper in. It's warming up. Let's not keep our eyes off of it for too long. Can we do two? Wait a sec. I think if you, the middle slot is the hottest one. So if we do two over there, it'll heat up slower. And let's put our anvil, our first anvil we'll put over here. Okay. Oh! <laughs> I unconverted it. Oh, I gotta maybe click it with the hammer? There we go. Okay. Get our flux inside. How's this doing? Still, still going. Okay. Uh, let's set up a table. Temporary table, anyway. Over here with our ingots on. Oops. <laughs> they look cool. You cannot store these in chests, by the way. Or even in like a ceramic vessel or anything like that. Uh, same goes with logs. You can't put those in chests either. You have to stack them. So if I try clicking it in, it doesn't let me. Alright, so let's put this back. Oops. Okay. Faint red, very hot. If we put this one in the middle, maybe it'll catch up to this one. That one's a dark red. That's the hottest we got it before at the fire pit. Apparently, you can uh, get it to the welding temperature on a fire pit at our barbecue there. Um, but it's very difficult. Can work, okay. So when it's at that stage, you can make like armor and tools out of it. Can work. Dark red, bright red. Is it going to catch up? Oh, there's no... Uh, <laughs> we might need to put that there. I think the the coal or the charcoal slides down to the middle slot too as this burns away. Bright red, bright red. Three stars and one star. It's catching up, I think. Two stars, four stars. Can weld. Okay. That's what we want. We're trying to weld them together. I want it to go a little... Oh, danger. Let's pick it up with our bare hands. <laughs> Alright. Get in our anvil really quickly. Oh. Weld! We did it! <laughs> Copper double ingots. Oh, man. That is awesome. Alright, so I'm going to spend a little time here trying to... Uh, Convert all these to double ingots. We need seven double double ingots to make our copper anvil. Ooh. 
I'm going to do them all at once, too. Actually, I don't want one in the middle. Mm hmm. All right. Should we check on this real quick? <laughs> it's such a bad idea to leave that. I think I can do it quick enough, though. All right. Is this ready? It's not ready. Okay. I wanted to do that this episode, too, so maybe... I I'll cut here, and I'll, I'll work on this a little bit. I may have made a stupid mistake here. I don't think we have enough charcoal to do much more here. So I'm digging this while those ingots are heating up. And I'm going to be running back and forth trying to get charcoal to keep the fire going. <laughs> while my ingots are on the verge of being destroyed. Alright, this should probably do for quite a while. I'm going to head back. Oh yeah! Another one. I'm wondering, can we stack these? No, we can't. Oh. Do you know what's awesome about putting the forge here? You can actually see the chimney on the cabin. Oh, yeah. You got perfect angle over here. <laughs> All right, orange. Oh no, danger, danger. Weld it together, quick. Oh, don't give it water. That's actually. Wait a minute. I like that because then I can shift click things in. <laughs> Let's put something in that slot. Oh, and it displays on the top here too. That's cool. All right, this one. Oh, these are ready too. Danger, danger. Oh yeah. All right, we're almost done. We just need two more. Put those in. I'm going to go get... Oh, whoops, I just picked them all up. I'm going to fill this bucket with water, too. I think you can put the ingots in water to cool them quicker. So that'll be fun to try out. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. I'm almost dead. Oh, these stack together. Okay. That's good. I was wondering what I was going to do with them. Weld. I'm going to take these out too because I think we're done with the forge for right now. Bright red. Weld. Yes. We did it. We didn't mess it up. And let's see if we can... Oh, that is so cool. Cools it down instantly. Then you can stack them together. Otherwise, you can't stack them together. Uh-huh, so we got all seven. Now we can make the anvil. Oh, baby. And we are kind of done with this one, I think, so... <gasps> oh, that would have made me sad. <laughs> can we break this? Put our other anvil here. Do we have another smooth block? Oh, we don't. Here, maybe I'll just put this underneath. Make it look a little better. Copper Anvil. Oh, baby. We are moving up in the world. Cool. Uh, so before we end the episode, let us quickly check our tannin. I guess we'll probably save this for next time because <laughs> it's going to take another 12 hours in-game. But that washes the lime water away when we put in the water. And we have a small prepared hide. Last step of it, put it in well, it's not quite the last step, but yeah, we put it in here, seal it, and then you wait again. <laughs> Lots of waiting when you're making leather. All right, cool. Well, that was uh, this is a good episode. We did a lot today. Tried a lot of new things, too. Um, but that is going to do it for today. Thank you for watching. Why doesn't Nuggets sing? <laughs> Maybe because it's winter. Maybe he's gloomy like me. I don't like winter. I bet you in spring he'll he'll wake up again and he'll he'll be happy. Anyway, that's it guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.